Hey guys, Adam here with a software overview on the brand new iPod Touch 4th generation. Many people have been requesting that I did make this video, and you know, I wasn't originally because it's not the most important video in the world because the iPod Touch runs iOS 4, and I'm sure 99.9% .9 of you are familiar with the basic iOS 4 interface, but there are a few key factors that are different in the iPod Touch that I decided I did want to cover. And these are mainly regarding the new features to the iPod Touch, this is that there's now a back facing camera right there and there's a front facing camera so with that there's a new camera app and there's a new FaceTime app so that's what I'm going to be covering in this video and for the rest of the software on iOS I do have numerous iOS demos which you can check out in the links in the description so first off let's go into the camera and this camera is pretty simple it's identical to the iPhone 4's camera except the, due to the fact that there's no flash on the back there's no option on the top to adjust the flash like on the iPhone which I do have open right here as you can see there is a, a little option for flash right there on the top right now it's off you can change that to auto and on and what you also have on the iPhone is this little HDR option right there you can turn HDR on and HDR off HDR mode photo capture was just announced to be in iOS 4.1, but for some strange reason it was not ported over to the iPod Touch 4th generation. We can also switch over to the video mode and you can take the videos. This is 720p and there we go. That is the camera app and how it works on the iPod Touch. Next off we do have FaceTime. FaceTime on the iPod Touch is a little bit different than on the iPhone because of course there's no phone number on the iPod Touch. What you will have to do is, uh, when you click into the FaceTime app, it will prompt you to log in with your Apple ID, and this is what people will call you with. So let's take a look at FaceTime now. I'll give you a demo briefly. Um, in the FaceTime app, you do have favorites, which you know I haven't really done anything. Recents, which I did clear so you don't find my friend's phone numbers. And then we do have contacts, which um, here are some different contacts. I'm going to be calling myself on my iPhone, and we'll be testing this out. So let's wait for a call on the iPhone and see how this works. So as you can see here, my Apple ID would like to FaceTime. Let's accept. But here we go, they're both connecting. And it looks like we're on the call now. So this is basically how the FaceTime app will work. It's identical to the iPhones, literally. Of course, because you call people on the iPhone or iPod Touch. As you can see here, iPod Touch on the left, iPhone 4 on the right. But there we go, guys. This was the software overview of the brand new iPod Touch 4th generation. Thanks all for watching.